Anybody out there? Barrett! I think I hear him up ahead. Hey! Can anybody hear me? Here goes. And push! It was us. We did this. No. You can't think like that. Whatever came before, it was Shinra that pulled the trigger today. Am I right? Barrett. Marlene's fine. Huh? Aerith found her. Aerith? Is that the girl they took? Yeah. That's her. Hmm. The hell's going on? I asked Aerith to find Marlene and take her somewhere safe. And she did? You sure? Hey! Where are you going? How could this happen? I didn't really on? think that... When is hell going to arrive? This wasn't an accident, was it? I said, where you going? Aerith's house. It's in the Sector 5 slums. And that's where Marlene is? Where we hope she is. Tell me she is! Give me something to hang on to! 
Even if she's not, I won't blame you for it, I swear. Who am I kidding? I'd probably try to tear your head off. Hey, Tifa. Know anything about ancients? I know I've heard of them, at least. They come up in planetology books. Meant to be the original stewards of the planet. Could even commune with it, talk to it and stuff. That must be why the Turks wanted her so badly. Within my veins flows the blood of ancients. This planet is my birthright. <sighs> you have failed again, I see. <sighs> Through suffering, you will grow strong. Isn't that what you want? Cloud? Hmm? It's nothing. Let's go. There's a hole in the sky. Don't you worry. They'll be fine. Every plate's got its own support, you know. Whoa, someone forget a plate? Wait, over there. What the hell are they doing here? Their jobs, probably. Just focus on seeing Marlene again. Nothing else. Legit paralyzed with fear. I'm serious. Yeah. We ain't gonna get a better chance. Hmm. Uh, family in the Sector 7 slums. I'll pray for them. I never thought the plague would come. What's with all these soldiers in the streets all of a sudden? Found them? We're searching the compound as we speak, sir. We should go and help them. Anything? Nothing as of yet, sir. What? Did you find what you were looking for? Thanks to you, I did. Good. Now never let it go again. Everyone who had <sighs> the what first thing we need to do is find the plate. Is it yeah. true that Sector 7's pretty much destroyed? You guys run into Jesse at the pillar? Yeah. Biggs, too. Let they were through, both in it. pretty bad through. shape. But Wedge wasn't up there with them. He got out. All right. Come on now. There's no need to be afraid. We're all I've been scared. thinking, y'all. We gotta go find the others. Huh? If we don't look for them, who will? Uh, right. Hey, Cloud. Gonna need your help with it, too. Right. The plate, it's really gone. I thought it was a joke. My ears are still ringing from it. This is Sector 5, right? So where's this place you said Marlene is? Where I think she is. It's a house on the other side of town. Well, come on then. Pick up the pace. I'm going as fast as you are. There 
was this rumbling, and then all of a sudden... <laughs> That's the house. Marlene! Marlene! Marlene, is she here? Barrett. <sighs> Sorry, I'm Barrett. Marlene's my little girl. Marlene, she's got short hair. She's cute as a button, with the heart of an angel. She was wearing, uh, pink. She was wearing a she's pink dress today. Upstairs. Huh? Oh. <sighs> I said she's sleeping. I want to see her too. Come on, let's go look in on her. Keep it down. Don't wake her. Marlene, my baby, thank God. Shh. Hmm. <laughs> Shinra has my daughter now. I'm sorry. No, I'm the one who asked her to go get Marlene. We'd only just met, but she was so kind and helpful. I took advantage of her. It's not your fault. It was only a matter of time before she ended up back there. <sighs> because she's an ancient, is that it? So she told you about that? She must trust you all a great deal. Yes, Aerith is an ancient. Probably the last one living. She's not my daughter. Not by blood, I mean. If that's what you were wondering. about 15 years ago. My husband, he'd been shipped off to fight on the front lines. But then I received a letter saying he'd be home for a bit. So when the day came, I went to the station to meet him. But... He didn't come. I couldn't help fearing the worst, even then. But I told myself his leave must have been postponed, that he'd been delayed. Every day I went, to wait and to pray. And that's how I met her, her and her mother. I thought maybe they'd run away from Wall Market, or that they were topsiders fallen on hard times. I'd seen that sort of thing a lot. Take Aerith somewhere safe. Those were her mother's dying words. My husband had been away for so long, and I was lonely. So I convinced myself the safest place for the girl was with me. It took no time at all for her to start feeling like family. She was a real chatterbox.
she told me strange stories, like how she and her mother had escaped from some sort of facility, and how she wasn't sad because her mother had just returned to their planet. Their planet, huh? Yeah, that sounds about right. <sighs> I didn't understand any of it at the time. When I asked if she meant one in the sky, she said no, this one, right here. I mean, what can you say to that? Mommy, don't be sad. That's what she said to me one day, out of the blue. So I asked her, what's wrong? A man you really, really loved just died. His heart came a long way to say goodbye. But he couldn't stay because he had to return to the planet. I didn't believe her, of course. And then, a few days later, I received a letter saying my husband had been killed in action. Things like that, she'd just know. It was a lot to deal with, but we were happy. <laughs> and then came the knock. Coming! <sighs> no! Go away! Aerith, hmm. you know you're not just any little girl. You're a descendant of the ancients. I had no idea what he meant, so I said, who are the ancients? They were the original stewards of the planet, whose boundless knowledge and wisdom shall guide us to the promised land. <clears throat> Some believe the promised land to be a myth, others an allegory of sorts. But we take the words of the scriptures at face value and believe it to be quite real. Which is why Shinra would like very much for Aerith to help You're us- You're wrong! I'm not an ancient! <sighs> but Aerith, even when you're all alone, don't you hear voices whispering secrets? No, never! <clears throat> but all three of us knew that wasn't true. That man knew exactly who Aerith was, where she'd come from, and what she could do. They knew where she was, but they didn't just take her? Doesn't sound like the Turks I know. She had to come willingly, otherwise it wouldn't work, they said. That's why, even if they did take her away, I'm sure she's still being treated like a guest. And that they'll send her straight back home once they get what they need. I doubt it. You're not planning anything, are you? Don't make things worse than they already are. If I lost her, too, I don't know if I could, if I could ever. Just don't. Cloud, maybe she's right about this. Maybe they'll let Aerith go when it's all over. Maybe we'd be better off waiting a little while. Let's head back to Sector 7. Got things to take care of. Like checking up on the bar. Yeah. Okay.
The main entrance to Sector 7 is buried under rubble now. So how are we supposed to get back inside? Underground passage in the park. Ah, good plan. But how do we get to the park? I know another way to get there. Aerith showed me before. <laughs> this ancient girl knows her stuff. My Didn't mean anything so by it. First it was all like shaking, then it was all like... So, what are we gonna do with our... Fire at the pillar. Now, breaking news. Midgar is in the morning. Oh, following just the plan, right? Sector 7 place. Just huh? the city officials are currently restricting access to emergency responders. And urging people in neighboring sectors to remain indoors until further notice. Also, send your help announced to establish. My ears are still ringing from it. This wasn't an accident. This kind of thing isn't supposed to happen. Over there. Keep moving. Y'all ain't nothing. Easy now. Uh. Huh. Come on. All right, enough. It's blocked. Duh. There, that way. We'll have to fight our way through. But it's our only shot. Don't hold back. You got it. That's that. Was never in doubt. That's that. Come on! <laughs> 
See ya. Going in. That's that. Keep it up, man. Yeah, you too. Get the hell out of my way! You heard the man! I'm waiting. Guess it's my turn! Let's do this. Keep it together. All set! Finish him off! Now's our chance! You ain't gonna get away! Get ready. It's over. It's on now. Enough. See ya. That's that. Ain't got nothing on me. Turn up the pressure. <laughs> Sounds like a plan. Gotcha. Let's do this. Come on. <laughs> oh. Bam. No holding back. <laughs> Here it comes. Come on. Here we go. Those gloves up. Sure thing, coach.
all don't have a chance! Yeah. Yeah. No holding back. Enough. Good job. Whatever, man. Let's go. Y'all don't have a chance! Yeah! Shit. Time to burn. And don't come back. So fast! Huh. You wanna come through here, you'll need to provide due compensation. You said it! Friends of yours? Nope. <laughs> Calling lightning! Finish this. Got yeah. It's over. Come on. Keep it up, man. Yeah, you too. Finally, those assholes were really good. Here we go. Gotcha. See ya. How'd you like that? <laughs> Let's move, move, move! Not so fast. Over there. Huh? That a way out? I'm almost afraid to go back. To see it with my own eyes. Tifa. Uh. Come on. Does it look like we can go this way? No. There's monsters everywhere. Take us straight to the Sector 5 slums.
Still in one piece. Who else made it out? I wish I knew. Sorry. Oh, it's fine. I'm just glad you survived. Gives me hope for the others. Hmm. This is bad. <sighs> Never know what you're gonna run into out there. Best be prepared. Careful out there. Sector 7, huh? Yeah. Left a few things behind. I see. I know it's not much, but it's all I got. This is bad. <sighs> Let's see what's on the other side. Finally, I can use some fresh air. Damn it! I still can't believe this happened. You can rest easy, folks. We can assure you. Listen, Sector Six is right over there. We just need to walk a little bit longer. That's all. All the more reason to go someplace new and start over. I wish hey, I hadn't made it out. Going? Don't you. say that. Well, Things will work out for us. They always have. I suppose you're right. The house was pretty old. And it's not like we had a lot of money saved up. Again? That one was a lot closer. Hello! Is there anyone out there that needs some help? <sighs> My God. Just a little more. Come on. Come on. <clears throat> it won't budge. Make room. <laughs> Mara, you're alive. <laughs> With me. Ready? And... <clears throat> Great job, guys. Thank you. <laughs> I can't tell you how relieved I am to see you. So, what now? Don't know. Find something, anything to do. Been back to the bar yet? No. Maybe you should go take a look? <sighs> okay. First the bar, then the rest. Careful. The roads are a mess. Watch your step, or you'll wind up in a hole. Hello! Anybody out there? If you can hear me, Anybody say something! Anybody out there? We're here to hey. help! Hey! Can you hear us? If you can hear me, shout! Can you hear me? Anyone there? Hey! Hey!
Tifa. Get back! Ah. Shit! Hear that? That's Wedge's cat. What? Let's follow it. Ready? One, two, three! Is this all that's left of Wedge's place? Hey! We're coming down! Stay right where you are! <laughs> this place reeks of Shinra. Wedge? Wedge! Uh. Of all the times! If there's no path, you gotta make one. 